Hi everyone! Today, I'll show you how to change your Apple ID photo on your MacBook. First, open System Settings. You can do this by clicking the Apple logo in the top left corner of your screen and selecting System Settings. When the window opens, look at the top left corner, and you'll see your Apple ID photo. Click on it to open the photo editor. Here, you'll see several options on the left to change your Apple ID photo. The first one is Memoji. If you love fun and animated expressions, choose a Memoji from the list. You can customize its pose, expression, or style to match your personality. If you want something simpler, select Emoji. This allows you to use any emoji as your profile picture. For a more professional look, you can choose Monogram. This option displays the initials of your name in a clean and minimalistic style. If you'd prefer to use a picture of yourself, select Camera. Your MacBook will turn on the webcam, and you can take a new photo right away. Alternatively, if you have a picture you've already saved, select Photos. A window will open showing all the images in your photos library. Simply pick the one you'd like to use. If you're unsure what to pick, check out suggestions. Apple offers a variety of default backgrounds, including icons, landscapes, and other fun options. And here's a really quick method. If you have an image saved on your computer, you can simply drag and drop it directly into the editing window. Your MacBook will automatically detect and apply the photo you dragged in. It's a super quick way to update your profile picture. Once you've chosen the perfect photo, you can adjust its size and position using the slider below. When you're happy with how it looks, just click Save to apply the changes. Now, your new Apple ID photo will sync across all your Apple devices, including your iPhone, iPad, and MacBook. And that's it! With just a few simple steps, you've updated your Apple ID photo on your MacBook. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like to support the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.